welcome back to NRM 638, Python Scripting for ArcGIS Applications. Spring Semester 2015. This is an e-learning class at the University of Alaska Fairbanks. In this session, we're going to create a Python add and extension. And if you go to ArcGIS Help in the guidebook on Python add-ins, a Python added extension can be used for different ways. So the first way would be to group associated functions together. So example might be the 3D analyst extension, the business analyst extension, geostatistical analyst extension, etc. The second application, extensions are responsible for listening to and responding to events. So for example, anytime a layer is added or removed, an event is triggered and your extension might respond to that event. And then the third would be extensions are used to coordinate activities between components such as buttons or tools. Okay, so down at the bottom they give you an example extension. So this extension is going to automatically add a base layer. So basically on a new document add a base layer automatically if it's not ready added to the map document. And then on, on open document, here's our base layer. So basically, this world street map is automatically added as a layer anytime the user starts ArcMap. Okay, so then if you go to this part of ArcGIS Help, there's functions for extensions. So we're going to work with a function on startup do something. So this will occur every time the user fires up ArcMap. And then whenever the user opens an MXD, what we'll do is make all the layers visible set to false. And that way we don't have to wait for all the layers to be drawn. We might be getting those layers across a network or they might be very large data sets. Okay, so that's what we're going to do in this video session. So the first thing we'll do is we'll create our Python add-in extension. So we use the shortcut to the add-in assistant wizard and then browse to the folder where we're going to create our extension. So I made a folder that's a new empty folder called add-in extension and then we can fill in our project properties. Okay, so my description is this extension responds to the ArcMap startup event and the ArcMap open doc event and then we'll go to add in contents and right mouse click create a new extension and then you would simply click on the methods that we're going to work with so we're going to work with the method startup and open document and then save and then we'll edit our script so anytime arcmap starts ArcMap is going to look for add-ins in the well-known folder and execute those add-ins. So on startup, we could execute any kind of housekeeping code that we want to. What we're going to do here is we'll just have a message box anytime ArcMap starts. So I added a message, all map layers will be checked off at startup. And then the title of my message box will be ArcMap Startup, and then it'll be high style zero. So it'll just be an OK button for the user. And then whenever the user opens a document, that's where we want to turn off all the layers automatically. And that will speed up the process that it might take five minutes to draw all the layers in this open document. So we'll use ArcPy mapping to get this current open document and make that a MXD object. And then from our current MXD, arcpy.mapping list layers. So we have a list of all the layers in the map document object. And then for every layer in our list of layers, we'll set the visible property to false. And then we'll print to our Python window, layer turned off, and then the layer name property.
And then we'll refresh the table of contents and refresh our active view. And then we'll save our work and we'll check for any syntax errors. So save and then check for syntax errors. Okay, so no syntax errors. So now we'll create our add-in and then install our add-in. So make our add-in and install our add-in. And then we'll test drive it in ArcMap. Okay, so here's an MXD from week nine that we used to create our PDF map book. So it was large wildfires and we, we initially fired up. It had two data frames, it had a hill shade and then the wildfires from 2014. So we'll open this MXD and it should look for the extension in the well-known add-ins folder and then execute that extension. So the first thing we do is we get this message box on ArcMap startup event. All map layers will be checked off at startup. And then OK. And then basically we'll get the open document event and then it turns off all the layers. And then if we look at our Python window, we had a message turned off large wildfires, raster elevation, hill shade. So for every data frame in our map document, it automatically turns off all the layers. So it doesn't take time to draw those layers because they're automatically turned off. And then the user can turn on whatever layers they want to turn on whenever they want to turn them on. Okay, so that's how Python add-in extensions work. And if we go to customize extension, you can see that here is our new extension. And then if we don't want it anymore, we could always go to the add-in manager and we could remove this from the well-known folder. So now we remove that extension and it's still in the folder, the local folder where we created our extension. So we could always reinstall it if we want. So here's our original extension. So now since we removed that extension, let's fire up that same map document. So we won't get the message box at startup and we should see all the layers will be turned on this time. So all the layers are turned on. So if you go to the Blackboard website, I've got the last video session ready for you.